it seems to me that the heartbeat of our era is really war and aggression. But not so long ago, this seemed an impossible thing. And in parts of the world, we lived in safety and denial. For persecution, extermination, murder, constant survival mode, no times for past or future, just kind of present. We try to just to keep peace and not to, to control. One day in the summer of 1992, I drove into the besieged city of Sarajevo, armed only with a pair of cameras and 30 rolls of film. I ended up staying longer than expected. Along the way, and over many years, some of the photographs I made came to assume a life of their own. This is a story of Sarajevo. Lessons for a troubled world. Before Sarajevo city, we are all mixed. We never ever have any single problem about religion. Different names, so what? Compassion, affinity, helping each other in contrast with uh, aggressiveness, destruction, and hate. Sarajevo became famous in the modern era for hosting the 1984 Winter Olympic Games. Nothing was better than my Sarajevo. If someone wants to go to Yugoslavia, then they will call him Ljubo Nostalgičar. So I don't want to talk about it, but it's true. Okay, everyone remembers some of their young age with some nostalgia. It was better when he was young. It's much better to run away from war than make a war. Evil is not characteristic to any particular ethnic group. Every human seemed to have that small fascist in his head, and it would be very dangerous, actually, not to recognize that. What happened in Sarajevo, it can happen in the middle of Paris, in Roma. It's possible. 